what kinds of things did you talk about? Did he ask you about the programming that you do? Or? No, he didn't ask me about the programming that I do. He asked me about my religion. He asked me about that um, so I belong to Festalbad and a city of Pakistan. And um, he was just talking about these things. And I asked him a few questions. I asked him that uh, why aren't there many kids around? Why aren't kids uh, can you now? Why kids can't uh, you know, join your company? Why do they have to wait so much to join your company? <laughs> <laughs> so he said that kids should concentrate more on their uh, studies, school studies. He didn't offer you a job. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> and the, the, he said that we do internship in the summer. Uh, with kids, high school students, like the youngest is 14. And uh, so the next person I asked him that where and there are many women around here. <laughs> what, and, what did he say to that? Yeah, he said that women, uh, it's hard to get women interested in technology. There are not more many women interested in technology. Um, I think Microsoft's about 75% are, are, are men uh, yeah. at the company. Uh, but that's relatively common in the industry. Yeah. Does that surprise you? Did, there, did it surprise you not to see more women around? Yeah, because because there would there must be uh, you know there, it would be it should be balanced, balanced equal amount of men and equal amount of women. Yeah, yeah. Because <laughs> yeah. it was developing Windows applications. The exam was developing Windows applications. Good. Now, have you, apart from the exam, made your own programs, your own Windows applications? Yeah, but they're quite, uh, you know, little ones. Like, I made them when I was studying something. Like, when I was studying uh, logic development, I made a program that, uh, you know, did sorting in ascending order, descending order, and in alphabetical order. And that was a program. And then and I have made a calculator and uh, that only did plus, minus, multiply, and divide. And um, I had made a program that uh, when I was studying loops, that you put any number, you'll enter any digit, and it will show you the table of that. Yeah. So what language, when you're doing that, what, what computer language are you programming? C sharp. C sharp, okay, good. Do you, have you tried other programming ones as well? Uh, yeah, a bit, a little bit, maybe last night a little bit, but I didn't make any program in that. Uh, I know a little bit of code in Ruby.net, you yeah, know, if you will see me through declaring variables in Ruby.net, I'll be able to do that. Mm -hmm. This type of stuff, and I know a bit syntax of G Sharp too, because it's, it's really matching, it's, it's the same as C Sharp is. Besides computer, my favorite subject is maths. Because if you are good at maths, you you'll be able to be a good programmer. I like maths; it's interesting. And um, so I will be studying maths there. Do you think you might study computer science as well? Yeah, okay. I might. Okay. And do you know what you want to do after you get out of college? Yeah, uh, for I want to do satellite engineering too. I'm sorry, I didn't understand. I want to do satellite engineering. Satellite engineering. Yeah. Okay. And what what attracted you to that? Uh, because you know there are so because um, it's you know, the world is now it's being uh, well, now the world is being wireless you know and it's going on satellite and so that's why there's a lot of need of satellite engineers there. Gotcha. That's why. Yeah. Would you ever want to come and work for Microsoft? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Do you guys have a satellite engineering division? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll, I'll work in the developer division. Yeah. I'll work in the developer division. Okay. <laughs> if you want to do something big in your life, you must remember that shyness is only in the mind. If you think shy, you act shy. But if you think confident, you act confident. Therefore, never let shyness conquer your mind.